So let's talk about our sleeves, okay? At this point, you wanna push your sleeves inside your coat, okay? Take your sleeves and push them inside the coat. All the way in, as though you're gonna wear them, okay? So that's one sleeve. And you wanna do the same thing for the other sleeve as well. Both sleeves, push them in. Beautiful. Now what I like to do is literally at this point, once I've pressed it really well, put my coat on. Put your coat on. Now, when you put your sleeves on, what you're looking for, and all I'm doing is just putting my hand through my sleeve, making sure that the seams match up, okay? So I'm gonna bring this closer to the camera. Remember, and you have two seams in your sleeves, okay? Make sure there's no twisting in your sleeve. That's why I recommend you put the entire coat on. It's nice and comfortable. There's no twisting in the sleeves. And you wanna match up just one of the seams, just one, okay? Just one of them. So now that I have my hand here, and if you're doing this by yourself, maybe you need to put a pin here. Right along the edge there, okay? So I'm gonna put my hand in my sleeve again. Some of us can just catch it and hold it and pull it to the, pull it from the inside, meaning the two layers, okay? So I'm gonna hold on to my sleeve with my hand, there's a pin here. I'm gonna reach in with my other hand in between the layers. And at the same time, I'm going to bring this sleeve to more to the inside of my coat. See that? Because I wanna catch this in the inside, meaning between my two layers. I don't want that bundle run up too much for me. So what I'm doing with this hand is literally going in between the two layers. I'm going in between the lining and the coat and I'm coming up to the sleeve and I'm catching where my hand is, where that pin is. Oh yeah. And I'm just gonna grab it with my two fingers and pull, let this hand go, because my other hand has the pin in the seam in place. Pull it, hold on to it. And again, you're going to be pulling it through from the inside. Now, what does that look like? It's gonna look like this. And in your diagram, in your instructions, it's gonna look like this, with the lining coming towards it and the coat is coming towards it. Now, if you look closely, we have the wrong sides facing each other. What we really want is the right sides to be facing each other. So what I'm gonna do, because I know this seam goes to this seam, just in case you mix them up, hey, put a pin in it so you know pin there, pin here. I know that this seam, laying that flat for you, I know that this seam goes to this seam. So when I remove that first pin that I was holding in my hand, I wanna bring those seams together so they're facing right sides together, not wrong sides. So let's reach in and I can feel that pin. That pin is right there, take it out. I'm gonna come back. Take that seam from my lining and the seam from my coat and bring them together right side facing right side. And that's what we want you to do. Beautiful. Sorry about that. Now I wanna go ahead and pin this all the way around. So I'm going to go ahead and continue pinning all the way around. keeping them together right side to right side. It's gonna feel weird, but believe me, it will keep your lining, it will bring your lining and your coat, hem together. Now, if you wanted that little, your lining to come to uh, sit more into your coat, then a good way of doing that is just cutting off an inch off your lining. That way the hem will sit inside of your coat more. And that's only for my intermediate and advanced students. They'll know exactly what I mean. But for my beginners, stay with this technique first, okay? And so I'm coming across that second seam and I'm just keep going around and around. 
making sure I'm matching up the raw edges of my sleeve hem all the way around. Beautiful. So now that I have everything pinned, now it's time for us to sew.